Whether you're new to Tampa Bay or a longtime resident, leaders are finding more people are taking advantage of alternative transit options like the Cross Bay Ferry or here, the streetcar. Let me bring you up to speed on different ways people are choosing to enjoy Tampa Bay and the records they're setting. With more than 53,000 passengers last year, the Cross Bay Ferry reached uncharted waters, coming a long way since its maiden voyage in 2016. It's why local leaders are working to turn the seasonal ferry into a year-round service by 2024. It's a congestion-proof Florida-style transit option between Tampa and St. Pete, allowing riders to take advantage of several things like shopping, eating at restaurants, go to events, and more. Other travel options more people are taking advantage of is the free streetcar. The Tico line running through downtown Tampa up broke ridership records this year, making it the second busiest streetcar in the nation behind Kansas City's streetcar. While the city of Tampa says it's mainly used by tourists, ridership increases during big downtown events like lightning games and concerts. Other transit options people are using more of include city bike rentals and e-scooters. In the city of Tampa alone, e-scooters have logged more than 3 million miles. It shows more people are interested in finding other ways to get around, especially with high gas prices, and they're able to take advantage of more of what the city has to offer.